spoke about earlier in this podcast, uh, the past week has been very emotionally draining for a lot of people in this country, particularly black people in this country. Um, I can definitely say that the last week has been particularly draining for me, not because I'm black, as I will say again, I love being black, but it's emotionally draining living in this country of the United States of America, which is extremely racist and has had a long racist history. And this is also draining for our other allies, our other, other folks of color, our Latino brothers and sisters, Asian, uh, what you know, native indigenous folks in this country, they see this stuff as, is when you see what happened to Jacob Blake, it's very draining. But then on top of that, uh, and I and I'm not speaking for all the black community, but I'm speaking for myself. Uh, to learn early this weekend the the death of Chadwick Bozeman, man, that really hit. That really hit, and I know it hit for a lot of uh, black folks because you think of the important iconic roles that he's played as a black man and what he accomplished in such a short period of time at the age of 43. Uh, for people watching this podcast, you see I'm wearing a Black Panther shirt. You can see I got Black Panther, Chadwick Boseman, uh, iconic role that he played, probably will be one of his best known roles right behind me. Um, we spoke on this podcast after I saw Black Panther and how important it was for me to see that, how important I knew it was for young black kids to see that. I grew up never seeing a black superhero. Brian has still sadly never seen a Latino superhero feature, prominent featured. And we're hoping that day comes for our Latino brothers and sisters. And I'll be right there watching when that comes. But it's because of people like Chadwick Boseman and what we see and how they play in those roles, it's important. And when that person comes for the Latino community and for the Asian community and others, people are going to have that same level of pride that I'm talking about right now. That's why these things mean so much. Him playing Jackie Robinson, one of my idols in sports, somebody I've always looked to as a role model because of what he stood for uh, in sports. James Brown, great iconic musician. These are the roles Chadwick Boseman played. And when you think about him doing that stuff at such a high level, uh, this in his, his career, what he meant, man, it's a lot. And I think for black folks and myself to, to lose one of our heroes, we lost the Black Panther, as people have called him. We lost the Black Mamba earlier this year. This stuff really touches, especially when we see our brothers and sisters and people of color being killed in the street at the hands of police or not being killed and paralyzed like Jacob Blake. It hurts. And, you know, we heard Jamal Bailey earlier in this episode talk about when is enough going to be enough? That is the question that people are asking. That is what people want to know. That's why we have to use our voices. That's why Brian has to speak his truth. I have to speak my truth. You, the listener out there and viewers, have to speak your truth because there are people like you can leave a mark. You don't have to be Chadwick Boseman in a movie, but we all have a part to play. We all can touch people's lives the way Chadwick Boseman touched mine, Kobe Bryant may have touched mine, or whoever your heroes out there may have touched yours. It's that representation that matters, that seeing somebody that looks like you can do something, even if it's not in the field that you do. And that stuff matters. So I just want to give a salute to in what's been a difficult time for people to Chadwick Boseman for what he did and the impact he left particularly on the black community and will continue to leave li uh, excuse me leave in his presence for years to come um I know I will feel it I know my daughter has a Black Panther toy and she hasn't even watched a Black Panther movie but I'll watch it with her and share with her about Chadwick Boseman and what, and what he meant uh to the community and what he's done so salute to Chadwick Boseman uh, everything that he did in his career, uh, Black Panther is had a great legacy, and uh, Wakanda forever.